Hello, hello, my lovely, beautiful people. Welcome to the Creative Lab. Today's video is a tutorial on how to create amazing, stunning mockups in Figma. These plugins are pretty straightforward to use. This short, under five minute tutorial will cover the basics and more advanced mockup features. Before starting, I've picked up four wireframes from the community section in Figma, and I'm creating a frame for each one of them. Setting up the same dimensions. In this case, 375 by 812. And I'm dragging the wireframes inside the frames. Great, so the first mockup I already have it installed as you can see at the plugins menu over here. It's called Clay Mockups 3D. Just select the wireframe and automatically it will be placed on the display. And here you can see how it would look in the device. There are several devices to choose from my iPhone, iPad, different angles. I will look on a MacBook. Great. Okay, so I'm using the iPhone and I'm just going to move it here. You have a lot of flexibility of movement up and down sides even backwards and you can adjust the degrees for accuracy and the camera rotation once you're satisfied just hit the save as image and the image will be placed on Figma file. I'm creating um just okay so I'm here I'm just going to very quickly um see how it looks in a presentation. Also in Clay Mockups 3D, you can choose the color of the device. So here we have all kinds of color, black, white, yellow, orange, blue. The next one, this is an awesome, more advanced mockup tool because it has more elements, but still is pretty simple to use. Factory beauty elements, and here we see all kinds of elements that can be used for mockups. Placing the wireframe in the mockup on the device, and here we have the option here you can edit the photo. There are several options lightning, intensity, brightness, and the rotation. I personally really like this one because it also you can also see the shadow so that gives a realistic effect to the mock. -up. Nice, so next one we're gonna try it on a different device and see how it looks. So I'm just going to copy the create a frame and copy the physical track activity on a separate frame. And last but not least, 
Mockup Studio, idea for building up a scenario, making it more natural and giving a realistic feeling. There is a huge variety. Free and paid versions available. Thanks for watching another episode of the Creators Lab. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe right here. In order to be notified on any new video release. Thanks again and I hope to see you soon.